Okay, so here we are in the track editor, and what I'm going to show you is how we can change the way in which rotation works for multiple objects. So I'm just going to lay down two lines of cones here just to demonstrate this. So there's a couple of lines of cones, just line them up a little bit. You can see it. Okay, so I'm going to multiple select by pressing control. So I've now got both of these objects selected, and I'm going to go to the rotation gizmo and grab the central thing here and rotate and you can see that the compound object is rotating as one object but what if I wanted to make this like two parallel lines of cones and I wanted these to rotate individually around their center point well to do that you press the P key and then it rotates around the individual origin of all the objects you've selected so now if I grab this and rotate you can see it's rotating around the center points of each object or the origin point of each object. If I rotate it like that and then press P again you can see the gizmo goes to the middle now of the compound object and I can now rotate the compound object. Okay so that's how rotation modes can be changed for multiple selections. And I'll see you on the next video.